Hello and welcome back to our channel. I'm Danish, and you are watching Iraqi Dinar YouTube channel. Hopefully you all will be fine let's start today. We are delving into significant developments from Vietnam's financial sector that could have far-reaching implications for the global economy. Recently, the State Bank of Vietnam, SBV, made a decisive move by announcing its sale of US dollars to certain commercial banks, marking a direct intervention in the foreign exchange market. This intervention was triggered by the Vietnamese dong reaching a record low against the US dollar, prompting concerns about currency stability and economic impacts. Earlier in the day, an official from the SPV hinted at potential intervention measures, and shortly after, the bank confirmed its action, selling US dollars at an intervention rate set at 2,450 dong per dollar. This rate notably undercut prevailing market rates, emphasizing the severity of the dong's depreciation and the SVV's commitment to stabilizing its currency. The depreciation of the dong can be attributed to a combination of domestic and international factors. Domestically, Vietnam has been grappling with inflationary pressures exacerbated by global supply chain disruptions and lingering economic effects of the COVID-19 pandemic. Internationally, the strength of the US dollar, driven by the Federal Reserve's tightening monetary policies, has put downward pressure on many emerging market currencies, including the dong. The SBV's decision to intervene by selling US dollars aims to increase the supply of foreign currency in the market, thereby supporting the dong's value against further depreciation. Such interventions are common tools used by central banks to manage exchange rate stability in the face of market volatility. However, their effectiveness hinges on addressing underlying economic challenges and maintaining investor confidence in the currency. For businesses and investors operating in Vietnam, the depreciation of the dong has significant implications. A weaker dong can lead to increased costs for imported goods potentially fueling inflationary pressures domestically. Conversely, it may enhance the competitiveness of Vietnamese exports in global markets, benefiting export-oriented sectors such as manufacturing and agriculture. The ongoing intervention by the SBV highlights the challenges faced by emerging markets in managing their currencies amid global economic uncertainties. It also underscores the interconnectedness of global financial markets, where actions taken by one country's central bank can trigger ripple effects across borders, influencing currency valuations and trade dynamics. Looking ahead, the effectiveness of Vietnam's intervention in stabilizing the dong will be closely monitored. Will additional measures be necessary to shore up the currency's resilience against external pressures? The evolving situation calls for continued vigilance and potentially further actions by the SBV to safeguard economic stability and investor confidence. In conclusion, Vietnam's recent intervention in the foreign exchange market signals a proactive stance aimed at stabilizing the dong amidst challenging economic conditions. The implications of this move extend beyond Vietnam's borders impacting global currency markets and international trade dynamics. As events unfold, stakeholders will continue to assess the effectiveness of these measures in navigating the complex terrain of global finance.